For months, Katie has been on a global tour. Doing a portion of that show would be a safe approach, but that's not Katy Perry. And this is the Super Bowl. It's only 12 and a half minutes. You do like two hours and 12 and a half minutes every night. This is going to be fun. Yeah. We started dreaming it up when they started courting us, just because that's how you live. You fantasize about things. This is so exciting and official. <laughs> Baz is my creative director. He's really my co-captain. He knows my taste. I trust his taste. Can I know everybody's roles? I know some of everyone's roles, but I'd love to know what you specialize in so that I can come to you with specifics. So I don't ask for you to get me coffee or anything. I won't get you coffee. No, I, I get you coffee. Uh, Ricky Kirshner, executive producer of the Super Bowl halftime show. This is my ninth. So any of the last nine you didn't like, please don't mention them in this meeting. <laughs> The art form of putting on the halftime performance for the Super Bowl, they've got it down to a science. Bruce, you want to just show the video? Just show them the video. Show them the video. Wait, is this Phoenix? That is Phoenix, but... You guys played it before then, huh? So oh, who came cool. out? Who else came out for this one? No one. Just him. Just meeting her, I could tell she's super competitive. She's looking at a lot of guys that are twice her age, you know? I don't know what's going through her mind, wondering. Worrying, maybe. Can I say something that might be a little bit controversial? You can never put one band on the Super Bowl like that again. As much as I love and admire all those musicians that came before me, I think we don't have the attention span that we used to have. People know I bring a big show with a lot of fun accessories. I bring the bells and the whistles. I'm sure Baz has told you we've been in discussion about doing field projection sort of on steroids, bigger than we've ever done. I loved Madonna's projection. Right. And taking that... Did you think that that worked? Yes, very well. I think so, too. Taking that to the next step, we talked about two ideas. One, you interacting with it, and two, using big inflatables maybe out in the center of the field to give us some vertical. Yeah. I mean, is it worth considering looking at it slightly differently? For instance, as you reach a different part of the projection surface. You interact with different, to your point, dancers. A spiders. playground. Yeah, it's, it's exactly right. It's exactly right. But that playground idea, and you walking from one part of the playground to another, I really like, and it's never been done before. I think it's cool. We are not doing the show on the Super Bowl. We are creating a whole different, spectacular thing. This is the biggest audience that I've ever been in front of. So I'm going to make a big impression, a lasting impression, hopefully. On Super Bowl Sunday, I am going to literally burst into a firework on the stage. That's the close. At the site of Super Bowl 49, loading and construction is underway. The thing you want to do at the beginning of a design process for a halftime show is park in the back of your mind how it's going to be done, how we're going to get it out on the field. You have that short amount of time. We're talking seven and a half minutes before the show. Then you have your 12 minute performance and you have to leave pretty fast. You have to leave faster than it took to come in. But you, you can't design for time. You gotta think huge, because it's a Super Bowl. That's where it gets real. <laughs> I just want to make sure that, like, it never inhibits dancing. We got to physically rehearse for one month straight. First, we were in a dance studio because you don't get to always rehearse in a stadium. We have a rough structure all the way through California Girls. Do you want to just see the whole shebang that we have right now, or you want to just see one piece of it? I'd like to see this piece, okay. and then I'll see it again. Perfect. All right, guys, let's set up for Teenage Dream and Cali Girls. Katie is someone that genuinely having fun is one of her main priorities. <laughs> Dance and choreography is probably the thing she had the least experience and exposure in when we started with her, because she was already a great singer and could play the guitar. But I think movement and her sense of her body and her physicality is how we see her grow. I was never a dancer until about five years ago. I didn't go to dance class when I was a child, but somehow I turned into a dancer. We're 
rehearsals are just about chipping away at the performance. So it's so familiar. It's muscle memory is what they call it. You just do it over and over and over and you still do it after that. You're boiling down six months of work every day. All hours of the day, seven days a week, boils down to 12 and a half minutes. And for those 12 and a half minutes, everything's got to go right. Simple as that. So, we have two surfboards, eight palm trees, four beach balls, two sharks. Yay! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're crazy! Do you want to see your lion? Are you lion? I'm lion. <laughs> My entrance is on top of this lion. It's a huge lion, it's 11 feet. It was made by Michael Curry. It's just so magnificent. It has red eyes that light up and it moves like a real lion. And it's being moved by puppeteers. She has to come off that line in about two seconds to make it onto the field. We bring out literally a 14-foot pole that two guys hold onto, and she has to jump onto this pole. There's like no easy way to get off of an 11-foot lion. I didn't know I was gonna have to have the skill set of like a fireman. That was a pole moment. Yeah. This year's Super Bowl, I'll be sharing the stage with some special guests. Lenny is going to be joining me on I Kiss the Girl. It's the rock moment in the show. Missy is someone that we all know her songs, and her songs still play all the time, but you haven't seen her. When that first beat hits of Get You Freak On, dun, 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 people's faces are going to melt. I just cannot wait, because every time we're in rehearsal and we, we hear it, we go crazy, still. I go into this fun world that I've created with beach balls. You gotta make that noise you open your mouth. Sharks. Hi, honey. <laughs> palm trees. Hi, palm trees. Surfboards. Will you turn your side, please? And their mouths all move. Will you sing this song? Do you... <laughs> Do you feel like you have a handle on that costume? Like you're not gonna go timber at any point? Uh, Honestly. No, this is pretty easy. Can you do, do your dance? I am on the palm tree. Keep up. You have to open your mouth though, Scott. Bit more. Like ah. <laughs> People like to talk about the outfits, especially if there's something to look at, and my outfits are always a feast for the eyes. Jeremy Scott is one of my favorite designers of all time. We just have the same outlook on life, and you can see that in his clothes, and you can hear that in my music. <laughs> I think it's going to be a really powerful <laughs> We created this just cool red, gold, orange outfit. I just look like this bright, burning flame. Yeah. I'm on my way to steal a deal from my pharmaceutical <laughs> Underneath that, I will have a two-piece outfit that emulates a classic beach ball. We've decided that it will possibly be easier for me to do this. Okay. Yeah. I'll be changing a few times in the Super Bowl, which is crazy. And we're just kind of working that out now. When the kick comes in. So we need another person for Mike. Got it. Got it.
She's at rehearsal, she's running the show, she's probably run the show 50 times. You know, she's gonna be hopefully able to cope with anything that Super Bowl Sunday throws at her. And I was wearing the latex costume underneath my fire costume and my crotch just melted. <laughs> oh, burned a hole in my panties. That's a good test now. Katie heads to Phoenix with the time it takes for that first costume change still at issue. Well, I have never been so on time before in my life. Oh my God, oh my God, you're only six minutes late. I'm only six minutes late that's, and that's, that is early. the earliest I will be to my grave. And the show is by flying around the stadium on this um, shooting star for firework. And I fly a lot in my own show, but I've never flown in a stadium. Are you not scared doing this? What is there to be scared about? Falling Listen, off? if I die on the Super Bowl, <laughs> great ratings. Yeah. Great ratings. The great best ratings. performance I've ever done. <laughs> Your final performance. You it. Your curtain call. During her performance, the flying rig will travel 600 feet, suspended by four wires. The flying was the highest I've ever flown, I think. You just have to kind of keep your chin up and know that it's in the universe's hands. And if this is how you're supposed to go out, then say love you. <laughs> that is so high, Jay. Jay it is fine. so high. Have you guys been on it? I've been on it. You won't get me up there. No oh. chance. <laughs> I'd like to see you ride it. <laughs> Standby spots. And spots. Here at the Super Bowl, this is about a football game, and we're occupying 12 minutes in the middle of it. I think we went in the right place. But unlike any other show that you might do where you were going to rehearse this scene, you're going to rehearse that scene, and once you get all the scenes really rehearsed, we run it. This show, you just run it. There is no working on each piece. The spotlight definitely looks good in the background when you come around. You, you've got that flaring it out. Now it's, we're into Lenny Kravitz, but Lenny is in his own lighting. She's going to walk over. Don't be nervous. He's supposed to be in the dark because he's doing a wardrobe change. The first time everybody has got comments on the lighting. There's a mismatch between stage and lighting, I think, in terms of color. Yeah. That's one of the major problems. It's all getting washed out. Like yeah. The amount of bounce coming down off the white roof. Yeah. I think it's fair to say Bob got a bit of a kicking. So like, I don't mind simplifying the colors. I mean, I think let's look at it tomorrow, really. But you can simplify them tonight if you want. But I don't mind simplifying the color. But I don't think we got to get I can't get rid of all that activity. I can't, I can't imagine getting rid of all that activity. I mean, that's the end of the show. It's got to be big. What walk-up music do you want to be playing when you walk onto the press conference stage? I think Roar. Okay. I'm just here so I won't be fine. I'm just here so I won't be fine. That's so cool. Coming to the public, to the people. months prepping for the best halftime show ever. And Katy Perry is going to have fun, no matter That's what. That's right. Here go the boxes. Yeah. This morning, the megastar is revealing some of the secrets behind her big night. The performer for the Pepsi Super Bowl halftime show, Katy Perry. Yes, 
so excited to have you out here. Thank you. That is... I feel like I'm dressed for the ball. <laughs> Can you talk about the artistic control that you've had over this performance and even what you're wearing, how much say you have in that? They call me boss lady on the field and off the field. There is not a, a diamond on the shoe that hasn't gone past my eyes. You're single girl, do you, is there, this is what you have your eye on this weekend. I'm just here so I don't get fined. <laughs> gloves are so trashy. I guess they're just using them because they're like the safest and most comfortable. Well, they're I don't want safe and most comfortable to be the words that are in my they're, costumes. All this is covered in gold. It'll be all gold underneath. Okay. Katie's all about the detail. Down to the stitch of a thread or a line on a glove. I love that about her. That's what I'm saying. This is perfect. Okay, just so we'll make just the make the clasp it in the front. Okay. And I need to rehearse with them at 7.15. Okay. We had rehearsals last week in LA. So it's like we were hearing her music, we were like, we just can't hear it. We were like, when we first saw her, she was like twerking on stage. She was twerking on stage. <laughs> Another night of rain requires the stadium roof to remain closed and the pyro element of the show unobserved by anyone inside. One minute. 45 seconds to the gun. Five, four, three, two, one. And they're off. The rain also creates difficulty for the field team members who have yet to get the 24 stage cards with a projection surface and 20 audio cards containing over 100 speakers onto the playing field in the seven and a half minute deadline. Bikini babes are here. Hey ladies, how's it feel? This feels great. Your hair is a little bump. Yours needs to be fixed and yours needs to be fixed. There's a little extra like hair on, on the on your right this, okay. this side? Yeah. Oh, right here? Yeah, okay. I don't know what's going on with that. I'm the one that knows how I want to present myself. It is incredible attention to detail. Throughout my whole career, I've had it. I think it's been one of my best strengths. Okay, okay. cool. Thank you. Thank you. Can we fix that sock? It's bulky. It's like they're hiding something. Oh. That's not cute. I'm a control freak. Just go put your gauntlets on too. Horses All the horses come up here, please. Horses, you're cool. Great, you guys are great. Get right there. All right, bishops. Are you, Sammy, have you been touching your nose? Yeah. Tell. I'm sorry. You're excused. Great, thanks, guys. All right, queens, come out. What about shoes for them? Um, I think they were all asked to bring their own black shoes. I want the same, similar black shoes, period. Okay. I don't want them in the room, the anything. You got it. Bye. So she's like, ladies and gentlemen, Lenny Kravitz. And then just, of course, watching that. Of course, don't. Yeah, yeah. Her in the hair. <laughs> this one? Yeah. No. I have it right here. What's up? Sounds five minutes, Lenny's out there. Well, I did, fine. but we'll, we'll do it. Yeah. Okay. Push it, Lynn, push it. Lovely. Two, Come on, it's been bold, let's be brave. I know, but you can push it. Three, four, shot, three. Six next. Two, two Looks good. Three, four, shot, six. Haley, my AD, will be calling the shots. One, three, six, camera seven next. One, three, seven, camera eight next. Rod, my TD, he's cutting it with like a little golden triangle, and without them, I can't do anything. Lovely. The first time I met Lenny was while we were rehearsing the show via singing with him. And we just kind of smirked at each other and found it hilarious that this was our first meeting, the rehearsal for the Super Bowl. Hold it. And push it, lovely.
Racing change there. Go on, nothing tricky about this shot. She was really late. Everything was off. Everything's a domino effect, you know? If I don't put the skirt up in time, then the whole thing doesn't work. Full body of her, please. Five. And the arms are going up on five. And six. Pyro on two. Let's uh, get it so we can show yeah, it. Guys, check it out. Yeah. Yeah. Take it out there. Joe, we're going to hold here for a minute. What happened? It's stuck on the, the zipper stop at the top. It does not work. OK. So what I am going to try is the black the covered There's going to be all kinds of equipment plane. coming up. we got to make them exactly the way that I've been wearing the other gloves. Got it. We kind of know already what the problems are. These were the rehearsal gloves. Okay, I don't know and the ones that we made out of this fabric is, are stiffer. I think we have to move like this bigger. a yeah. little bit, because this one is way up here. Yeah. There's a gusset underneath the arm that, that allows you to raise your arms because uh, for movement and choreography. When she raised her arm with this one, it, it, it tore more. So if you can wear the red one for the next one. No. It's going to come off. I don't care. You have 30 minutes to fix it. Oh, my God. <laughs> Project Runway, go. I'm such a bitch. Lenny's so kind and just so cool. He brings that classic rock and roll vibe to the show. How old is he? He is 50 years old. Where? Lenny he's Kraft, fine. he's sexy as hell. I mean, he's. I had a little twitch. <laughs> what do you think about these chess players? <laughs> <laughs> Our set is so rock and roll. Yeah. See you after. Thanks, Thanks for having me. Yeah, of course. The National Football League welcomes you to the Pepsi Super Bowl 49 halftime show. So Katie's on her way to the truck, everybody. All right, I'm gonna run back and tell them all the things to love. Hi, hi, Miss. Hello, darling. I didn't do great on this one, but it was for you. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Stop. I feel like you should go to that shot only when we're a more middle to end. Okay because there's not enough background. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't want to move from that spot. You know why? Why is that? Because I didn't have enough time even when I went. Oh, yeah. I didn't even make this. I barely made it. You made it. I know, but I didn't have it. My, my skirt wasn't all the way up. I need okay, to see that it? shot from front on. You're only seeing so a little bit of side in my face. OK, quite. I want to see full body. Are those fake? No, it's fake. Wow, that we did that tonight? Yeah. <laughs> 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 That's actually confirmed. Go Seahawks! I'll be eating pizza! <laughs> <laughs> Lots of it. Well Lots. Done. Good job, Katie. Long day. I just can't let my nerves get the best of me. That's all. I don't think you will. I think you're prepared, so you're going to just have to remember to enjoy the moment. Yeah, we're going to Don't do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! I already had a protein burger from In-N-Out last night. Oh, hi! Y'all, like, honestly, we're gonna be the best. Yeah, we are. I think our show is the best. Take it yeah. in, girl. Yeah, we about to kill. The sharks are insane. It's not very fun. The sharks are hilarious. You don't understand that, like, the sharks are gonna get so much love online. Well, today was the first day I saw it, and I was like, it's so that was funny. Like, it's so it's funny. So All right, guys, good luck. Wow. Yeah. And before the show on Sunday, uh, there will be 
a uh, communal prayer just to surround ourselves with some protection. Yeah. 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 Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I know I don't like compliments. I know. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome everyone to Glendale, Arizona for football's biggest game. It's Super Bowl 49. I had tweeted on the way over that I was doing this for the nine-year-old girl that had the dream. Going to bed made me anxious because knowing that I was going to go to bed means I was going to wake up to today. Here we are, kids! Here we are. I was emotional. Emotional that I was fortunate to be given this opportunity. It, it was like a very spiritual moment for me. This is the day. This is the day so that sure. the Lord doing? has made. Good to see you, girl. How you doing? Oh, yes. My pleasure, yeah. It's good to see you. So What's nice. That? Tonight will be great. Oh, huh? look at that. I am Perfect so timing, huh? I know, right? Yeah, I know. What do you I tried not to psych myself out too much. But yeah, of course it felt different. I was like, I'm never gonna do Super Bowl again. So take every moment in, live in that moment. Welcome to Super Bowl 49. Negativity in it tonight. Every stomp is a power stomp with joy. Amen. I'm so thankful that Lenny could be here. Let's give it up for Lenny. of you because you have chosen us Amen. and we believe that we are exactly where where we are supposed to be today at this moment and we will be present and conscious and we will smile and we will live in this 12 and a half did mess up. People don't know really who the director is. For Katie, if she messes up, everybody knows it's her. She knows that she has got to be on an A++++ game. That must be terrifying, knowing that 120 million people are going to watch this, knowing that this is going to define your career forever. You make me feel like a minute, dream, the way you turn me on. Of course I was nervous, but it was not a nervousness based on, am I gonna get something wrong? It was more of like butterflies. So it was just like excitement and adrenaline. Whew. Okay. All right guys, have an awesome time. I'll see you all on the other side. 
He gets the snap. He goes right. He goes left. He's hit as he throws a line drive. It's intercepted at the goal line. It was picked off by Seattle. Running to the Super Bowl 49's first big play. First quarter went very, very quickly, so Ricky's just got everybody on standby. Can you just make sure that Katie's team knows? Thank you. When's the sun going down? That's what they're worried about. 45 is sunset. Yeah, it's still going to be bright. Yeah. Let's pray for a lot of scoring. We don't want to start this till six. But it's not going to be dark, no matter what. It doesn't look like we're even going to make 5.30. I know. <laughs> Stop this clock. There's too much ambient light. That's our problem. Yeah. It just gets mushy. Five minutes of play left. Jeez. It's still bright out. It needs to be dark for the stage projection to illuminate. Simple as that. It needs to be dark to see the show. Walking in two minutes. Two minutes. I would just love for the sun to get to the horizon line so it's not coming in through those side windows there on the west side. OK, here we go. Yeah. And we're going. Kill it. And we're going. My god, three and a half. This is the day. This is the day that the Lord has made. That the Lord has made. I will rejoice. I will rejoice and be glad in it. And be glad in it. We almost walk out to the field. We are put in another holding spot, which is just a bathroom. I was a bit nervous, but I mean, I'm telling you, I couldn't have been more ready. I'm gonna wait right here. You can do this. You were born for this moment. You are worth it. This is exactly where you're meant to be. Here we go. Go on. Go on. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Thank time you. Out. Yes. Yes. There's the snap, and the handoff goes to Lynch. Bounces outside, hit on the side, over the right guard. He crosses the goal line and he's in on a touchdown run by running back Marshawn Lynch with 2.16 to go before halftime. All right, we've reached the two-minute warning here at the Super Bowl. The Patriots 7, the Seahawks 7. So two minutes of play left, everybody. Two minutes of play left. All spots Dallas. We will then do the show as rehearsed. Jesus, can somebody call a timeout or throw in a flag? This is like knowing your time of birth, <laughs> knowing your time of death. It's like the same feeling of like, OK, the baby's coming. Someone's dying. Four wide for Brady, second down and six from the 23 of Seattle. Shotgun snap, Brady winds up, arching spiral pass into the end zone. It's a catch made on the sideline, a two-handed club grab for a touchdown by Gronkowski. I love the Patriots. First and ten, 24 seconds to play in the first half. Shotgun snap goes to the quarterback who breaks the tackle. Wilson from the 35 to the 40, the sideline, the 45 to 50. Driven out of bounds, 17 seconds to go. Well, at least I know what it feels like to be at the very top of being tested to be nervous. I may not ever feel the same nerves again. From New England's 45, Seattle has it second and 10. Shotgun snap to Wilson. Shuffles up, long line drive outside the numbers. Leaping catch by Lockett on the sideline at the 20. Then he goes right out of bounds. A flag is thrown. Six seconds to play in the first half with the Seahawks driving. I talk a lot about the spiritual side of it all for me. When I was in the bathroom getting ready to go out onto the field, I heard a voice. It said, you got this and I got you. So I was like, OK. Wilson gets the shot, and there's a line drive in the end zone. It's a leaping two-handed touchdown reception. Matthews with the leaping catch. Seattle is within a point of tying the game two seconds before halftime. Seattle just scored a touchdown to another four or five. 
OK, everybody, got two seconds left on the clock. Two seconds left on the clock. Here's the kickoff. It is on the ground. It bounces to the 30, and it's picked up by Devlin, who quickly goes to a knee. But time has expired in the first half. Hey, I'm going to stay out and watch Katie Bird. OK, we go. Clock go. OK, everybody, eight minutes and counting. Yes, <laughs> Nobody out. Go, go, go. Go. All right, bring the rat. Bring the rat. Let's go. Let's go, folks. Come on, card two. Come on, bring that bad boy. Nice time on the field. Photograph regarding the um, line across her face, correct? Yeah. One of the most unique things about this show is that you don't actually get to see all of your cameras until about two minutes before you go. Okay, I am not good on cameras. Camera one has no power. Um, I think we might need a little bit more than 15 on the other end, Carol, just pre warning you. Okay, uh, Gary, I've got a camera problem. Camera 13, Kevin, can you hear me? I need a utility to camera one, please. Camera eight, Jay, can you hear me? I'm still three cameras down. Hey, hey, hey. Are you ready to go, Kevin? Rob, are you ready to go on camera one? Thank you. All cameras present and correct. Thank you, everybody. Now. All right, Spax, here we go. Carol, you can take it to 30 seconds. We'll be fine. This is a good show. Let's yes. keep it calm, keep it quiet, keep it focused, and let's get out of it. Yeah, happy to go. All set for half time. Thank you, brother. Oh, come on, let's go. Come on, Go on, health. I desperately try not to show my terror and my fear, but sure enough, my heart is pounding. Please. Okay, I want no cheering. If I make a mistake, I want no tutting. Let's keep it quiet. Uh, and then the next 12 minutes is just a train ride that I don't even remember. The most chilling moment for me was when I was on top of the lion and we were counting down. There was a guy and he just looked up to me and he just goes, you got this. You got this, Katie. And it just made me feel so confident in that one moment. I got this. In 10, 9, 8, Stand seven, by, Katie six, spots, one, three, five, four, and ten. Nice four, and easy, Mike Hall. Camera three, two, you can give me a bit more two, of the other side, a bit more lights one, on the other side. Zero, we are live. The National Football League welcomes you to the Pepsi Super Bowl 49 halftime show. Everybody was really 
psyched out by that lion. Then Dark Horse was a cool transition, watching like the floor drop out. People at home could have been hallucinating, you know? Stand by Katie Spots and go. Once I climbed the stairs to the dark horse, I turned and my foot just went, it like slipped. Thankfully, not all the way, because I could have slipped into a split. Back lights go. Stand by front lights, nice and easy. Ladies and gentlemen, ready for Come on, Katie, come on, Katie, come on, Katie. She's there, she's there, she's there. We've done it. Well done, Katie, well done, costume. Yes! Hey, nice.
beautifully done. Jaws dropped when they saw Miss Elliot again. I think she played the best songs for the house that evening. While she's finishing up Lose Control, I'm trying to just absorb every single second that's left of the performance. Go. Nice and easy, like you're filling out your tax return. Do you ever feel like a plastic bag drifting through the wind, wanting to start again? Do you ever feel just a paper thin, like a house of cards, one blow from caving in? Do you ever feel already buried deep? Six feet on the screen, but no one seems to hear a thing. Do you know that there's still a chance for you? Cause there's a spark in you. You just gotta die. sacrificing for the, that moment, but it was all worth it. Hey, Mary, I love you. Hey. Go Thanks, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, don't come on the field now. All done. That's the way you do it right there. Butters, you just don't care. Do you? <laughs> Butters is a nervous care. wreck. That couldn't have went better. Oh, it was beautiful. Butters. It was like everything was in slow motion. Really? When you're out there? Oh! I didn't forget any part. No, every part was so perfect. Yeah. Everything, the gloves just, came off. Oh my god. Give me some pizza. <laughs> <laughs> People have been dedicating six months of their lives more to this show. You killed yeah, it. Very good. It was the, so it was the best halftime show. You killed it. Watching Katie go do her thing. I feel incredibly uh, proud of her. You were the best you've ever been. Really? Were, were you yeah. nervous? You owned it. I wasn't nervous, actually. I felt like nervous. I was just in a rehearsal. Yeah. Well, I was. Well, right. yeah. Like all my cousins. <laughs> 
Missy Elliott is such a great collaborator throughout the whole thing, her and Lenny. She was so humble the whole way and grateful, and she was very emotional at the very end. I thank y'all. I'm humbly grateful. And it's just amazing. It's I mean, so fun, right? Yes. So weird. It's crazy. It's um This is my Super Bowl. The Super Bowl is two teams competing, and we're two teams coming together to make the best show possible. That's what it's all about. It's crazy. It's like being a astronaut or something. I guess I prepared my whole life for this one moment in some weird way too. It all made sense. It all kind of added up right. USA Today says Ready? Katy Perry blew away the Super Bowl halftime show. This one definitely went beyond my dreams. To all future halftime performers, be happy you have it, and then be happy when it's done. <laughs> and good luck topping that. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>